Hey up everyone, Clint here from Retro Rewind and we're here for another Hit Squad Sunday. Uh, game is loaded up, whiz ball. What can I tell you about this game? I have played it, I have played it, but I've not played it since I had this back in the 80s when I was a little kid. Um, now I'm just a little adult technically, you know, five, four, six. But there it is on the old cassette, shiny, shiny. Maybe we should start taking them out of the case actually, just show you the... That's what I should do, shouldn't I? Just pull it out, see, simple. So uh, yeah, whiz ball. There it is, and it's number four arcade game. So uh, we've actually done one, two, three, and number four. We're doing all right, actually. I've got up to number, yeah, we're all the way through. Yeah, we're going to play all the way through the numbers. We're doing all right. So yeah, Whistball, what can I say about this game? Absolutely nothing. I remember playing it. I remember, I think you select something and uh, you change this depending which way you want to shoot and bounce, I believe. When you bounce, it shoots different directions when you collect something for them. Maybe I should read the instructions before I play it. Maybe I should cheat a little bit and help give myself a bit of help on this one. But yeah, we're going to fire straight in. We're going to jump into this game. I am enjoying coming in here on a Sunday night and playing um, playing on the Amstrad. Just really, just there's nostalgia, flashbacks of back into the day when I had this, my dad built me this like computer desk uh, into the wall. And it had a proper, had a nice seat to sit on. It had a proper bit with the keyboard went underneath and the monitor on top. Did a really good job of it. I always remember that and building that for me. It's brilliant for the Amstrad. So, I hope I'm going to enjoy this game because last week's Crazy Cars was a bit of a letdown. So I'm hoping this is going to be a joystick only, it says on it. That's positive. It means I don't have to use my foot to fire anything. So, uh, yeah. Uh, what just trying to say? Miss, uh, miss this, and you're uh, missing the finest release of the year. Whizball is simply brilliant. Zap, zap, sizzle. AA master game. Ten out of ten. Well, says it right there. There's a review for you. Ten out of ten. Well, well, we're about to find out, aren't we? So let's jump in. Let's have a go and see if it's any good. Right then, let's see what this game's all about then. Oh, I remember now, yeah, you shoot. So yeah, you bounce off things. I think if you hold your, your, sh your shoot button, you can select different weapons when you collect them. I think you can go down the moles as well. There you go, press down on it. Oh. I'm not doing too well, am I? But I remember, I remember this game. The, um, the old, uh, memories are flashing back. Oh, I missed getting that. Get that one. Oh. Gone now, isn't it? So, yeah, you can, every time you shoot something like that, you can collect, oh, fuck that, Anna. You can collect it and it gives you a different weapon. Oh man, this is a tough game. Yeah, as you say, if you um, every time you collect one of them things, it changes your weapon across the front, across the top. So obviously you're gonna bounce off that, isn't it? Remember it being hard. There you go. So I'll get the next weapon. Oh, I've got stuck now, look. I remember getting stuck before. I think you just got to wiggle your way. There you go. Wiggle your way off. But I get stuck on it again now, look. <laughs> it's no sound. It's weird. Just... Yeah, no music. Sorry, shall I say, not no sound. There is sound, but no music. Go down here. Oh, I thought it was going to go down there. So as you can see, it's it's not impressive. Oh, shit. Look at that. Game over already. There's nothing... There's nothing exciting... <coughs> exciting about this game. I remember playing this as a kid, thinking this was a cool game. I remember it being hard. And now I'm finding out just how hard this game is. There we go. There's the second weapon it's got me. Well, 
can't believe it has. So it's got me multi shooting by the looks of it. I'm trying to see if I can wiggle my way. Keeps bouncing me that way, doesn't it? It's going to keep doing the same bounce, isn't it? There we go. It's shooting left, I don't know why it's shooting left. God, this is frustrating, this game. I don't know what's worse, this or crazy cars. You can't, because you're just going to keep bouncing. Then back to the beginning now. Oh, I should have pressed down then. I would have, that would have landed perfect. Oh, I have. Oh. Oh, shit. God, what a game. What a strange game. Oh, man. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, it's weird. No, no music. No music, really weird. Get it stuck on that again. Come on. That's only gonna let me go left. I, I, I tell you what, this game, it's it's not winning any points or no prizes, shall we say? It's definitely, uh, it's definitely not. Floating my boat, shall we say? It's definitely not doing anything for me. Oh, I thought I was going to try and get down there then. Oh. Last, last go then. This must be my last life, and I'm not having another go because it's, <clears throat> it's not worth it for you viewers, and it's definitely not worth it for me because it's. It's not the game, as I remember as a kid. It makes a massive difference, kid. I tell you what, I just remember, remember it being a hard game, and yeah, it is a hard game. Try to get down there, but if I can get down there and move the bounce, ah, oh, got that just perfect there. Try to see if I can select it. Do a different select because it just seems to be the same, the same old uh, weapon. Oh my god! Just bounce, whiz ball, whiz ball, and bounce in a bloody bell. Come on, do something different. Oh, I thought I was gonna go down there then. Oh, fuck's sake! Go down. Oh. Bounce back and go down it. Go down it, go down it. Nope. Come on, this game sucks. Come on. Just stupidly bouncing about now. I'm not getting it anywhere. I'm not getting it anywhere at all. Oh, come on, just go down at home. Oh, we're just going to be bouncing backwards and forwards. This is rubbish. Rubbish. Oh, stuff this. Oh, here we go. Oh, I'm straight in, straight out, lot. Well, oh, at least we died. Right, that is it. That is it. So, there it was. There was Whizball, ladies and gentlemen. Whizball. One for you to remember not to play, i got to say. I thought Crazy Cars was bad last week. The thing is, the memory of a child getting this... And I understand, like, today this is not going to stand up compared to, obviously, when it first came out. But that was just so frustrating. Just, there's just nothing about it. Like, there's no music playing. I can't remember how to change that. You're supposed to be able to press your, hold your fire button and move your joystick or whatever to move that. But I couldn't get it to do it to change my weaponry. So, I don't know. I just, it's a poor score out the doors, isn't it? It's like... 
I can't remember what I gave Crazy Cars, really, but I'm just going to give this, like, a 2 out of 10. It's just... I just couldn't get on with it. Like, you get stuck in the same bounce, so you're not you're not progressing anywhere because you're just bouncing between the two same... You then have to go backwards to go forwards. That's the thing with this game. Sometimes the way forward is the way backwards. But anyway, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to say. I'm sorry if you sat watched all the way through that. I know I had a couple, quick couple of games to keep this short because it's just going to be the same thing. Um... I'm sorry. I do apologise for showing you another poor game for the Amstrad. I'm not doing. I'm not doing it any justice. I remember this being awesome as a kid. Uh, there's got to be some great games coming up, and we are in the arcade. We're in the arcade, but we. Enjoy Racer was good. We are. Oh, there is some good ones coming up because, like, I remember Rampage and Renegade are coming up, and I remember them both being really good back in the day. They were good, so. Anyway, thanks very much. If you have sat through that and got to this point, thank you very much for sitting through it and watching it. I do appreciate it. And um, yeah, let me know what you think. Just your opinion in the comments below. Just have a have a have a have a pop at it. I don't blame you if you did. Thanks for watching and hopefully, please, please come back next Sunday. I promise the next game next in fact I'll flash next week's. Coming next week to Retro Rewind is Rampage. Not to be missed, yeah, because, uh, oh, £2.99 from John Menzies. Anyway, this was good on the Amstrad. This was good. I remember it being good. So, come back next week for Rampage. You will enjoy that one, I promise. Anyway, thanks a lot, and I'll see you on the next one.